Mercury. First, let's leave the Sun behind and touch down on Mercury for a closer look. Because Mercury sits right next to the Sun, it gets blasted with a level of radiation that's about seven times higher than what we face on Earth. This place feels like an enormous blacksmith's workshop, constantly blazing and roaring with heat. At certain times, it melts every bit of metal on the ground at a scorching 806 degrees Fahrenheit. And at other times, it hardens them at a bitter minus 292 degrees Fahrenheit. Nothing out there can easily handle swings that drastic. Even mechanical beings would need to be built from materials like titanium that resist melting under these extremes. To endure conditions here, colonists would have to grow a protective, heat-proof layer beneath their skin. It might be that our adaptable bodies figure out a way to create titanium on their own for protection. In that case, we'd meet folks sporting heavy, metal-shining skin who look nearly cyborg-like in appearance. Metal adds extra strength to the skeletal structure. Folks would grow shorter, develop stocky torsos, and pack on thicker fat reserves to manage those intense temperature whiplashes. On the flip side, since Mercury's pull is just about 38% of Earth's, arms and legs would turn lighter and more pliable. Yes, be sure not to overlook this point. When you come face to face with the locals, you'll absolutely want high-grade sunglasses. On Mercury, the intense sunshine can literally burn your vision if you aren't careful. Local inhabitants likely develop big, sturdy eyelids that serve as built-in shields for their eyesight.